Hello everybody, I am so excited to share with you the sweep command of Katia V5. This video has been extracted from my full Katia V5 course. If you are interested to dive into the full course, please click the below link in the description. There is a huge discount if you enroll from the below link. Please don't forget to like and subscribe our channel to get more videos related to Katia V5. For explicit, we have three different options with reference surface, with two guide curve, with pulling direction. And for that, the inputs are profile, guide curve, reference surface. With two guide curve, the input are profile, guide curve 1, guide curve 2. And for example, with pulling direction, inputs are profile, guide curve and direction. So first, we'll go through explicit. In explicit, to explore those commands, we need some basic sketches. So let's go and create those sketches cancel so first in this plane we'll create a sketch so we have created profile now let's create two plane at these two location let's go to plane and select normal to curve this curve and at this location let's say okay and one more at this location let's say okay let's create a guide curve in this plane so let's go to sketcher Let's create another guide curve in this curve in plane. Let's go to the sketcher again. Okay, second guide curve also created. Now let's go to our sweep command. So first we'll go through two guide curve and then we'll go to the reference surface. So first with the guide curve, we'll create a surface and then we'll implement this command. Let's go here. So it is asking profile. So let's say this is our profile and it is asking guide curve 1 let's say this one and guide curve 2 let's say this this one now if we say preview a surface has been created with two guide curve guide curve 1 guide curve 2 and this is the profile so you can see the material has been flown along with the guide curve here there is a curvature so the surface has been created with a curvature way here is a straight line so it's a straight line so this way the surface can be created with this option let's say okay now to implement the next option let's create also profile here so that based on this surface we can create another surface before that we need two more plane we don't need these two plane so we'll hide them So let's create a plane in this one at this location. Let's say okay. Similarly, in this one, in this location, let's say okay. Now let's create two different profile to implement the next command. So we need to draw one profile here and one profile there. So that this profile will be created based on this surface. So if we go to this plane,
let's create a curvature here so let's say this is 10 Let's come out and let's create similar profile in this side also. So true profile has been created. Now, if you go to this option, so now we'll go to the reference surface. If we select this, so let's say this is our profile and this is our guide curve and it is asking the surface. So this is surface, automatically it has taken. If we say preview, a surface has been created here and let's say okay so with this option we have created a surface in this site now let's go to the next command so with reference surface we have created now we'll go to the pulling direction so here also profile and guide curve let's say this one and it is asking the direction so let's say z direction you can give it here z component now if we say preview so a surface has been created so we used as an input a profile a guide curve and a direction now let's say okay so this surface has been created now if we double click on it and if we go inside in here angular sector there are four sector so this is one if you go to the next one or maybe another one let's let's say three if we say preview now it has created it is actually it's mirrored from this side to this side so like this way we can we can explore this command and as per our requirement we can position it so it's up to us so this way we can change it let's say okay so with the help of explicit command we have created this surface this surface and this surface so far i hope you are enjoying the sweep command and able to learn something new please like and subscribe our channel the eduq if you have any question related to katia v5 please shoot the question in the comment i'll try my best to answer you thank you